Hi there, welcome back to Firefighter Safety Tips with Firefighter Cat Ferrata. Welcome to my house, and right now we're in my kitchen. We're going to go over some emergency exit ways for earthquakes and uh, as well as fires. So in an emergency house, well, in any household, apartment, house, uh, even hotel room, which I'll go over uh, one day in a hotel, you want to find your emergency routes on how to get out. On any given day, at, at night, in the day, in the morning time, whatever, you want to know the ways out of your house. So the egress, right? And so you want to know front doors, back doors, side doors, whatever. But you also want to prepare with your family. Have a place that everybody can meet and everybody can safely get to that's away from buildings, things that could fall, things that are dangerous, in a safe zone. Okay, this is for earthquakes, this is for fires, and uh, right here, we're in my kitchen. So, now, in the middle of the night, if there was a fire, your room door's closed, first of all, when you're sleeping, remember that. But you want to get up, and you want to find the quickest and easiest route, the safest route. You get down low, and you go to the, the closest door or window, preferably first story window. Okay, and you make your exit. Now, the doors would be a kitchen laundry room door. Now, you never want to have anything blocking your door. Now, right now, I'm having some work done at my house. So, there's a washing machine right in the way. That's kind of blocking the door. That's not good. That's, in fact, quite dangerous, right? But here's the door right here. So, you want to have an easy way to get out, nothing to block your door. So that's one way. Another way would be a bedroom window. So if you're going to your hallway and you're walking in your hallway, you want to, you know, find a bedroom. Here's my son's bedroom right here. And you want to find the easiest way out, which could be a window. So that could be a, an a exit point. Okay. Other bedrooms would be like my bedroom. Now you could also go through the front door. The front door you go right here, this would be the most common. Right now it's Halloween, so we have our Halloween gear up. You can see scary stuff, but aside from that, the front door. So these are all exit points to, to exit the house. The designated place you want to look and find for safety would be basically in front of the house or in back of the house. And have this for your family for any given time that there is an emergency exit. If you're at a hotel, motel, if you're at uh, a friend's house, know the ways out. And that's important for any fire emergency or earthquake emergency. Thanks for joining. Tune back soon and we'll go over future firefighter safety tips with Firefighter Caffarata. Thanks for joining. Okay, take care.